Hello friends, the Ultimate Gamer 19 here, and welcome to part 52 of Let's Play The Sims 2 The Anderson Season 3. Here we are at Melissa's family, and you may have noticed that the, f the other family members, such as Gabriella, or Aaron, or Carol, or Glenn, are now gone out of this house, because they are now moving into their new own homes, and we have two new families that we are going to be showcasing, not really showcasing, but recording videos on. Sorry, I'm out of breath because I just like ran up the stairs and yeah, into the little studio I have going on here. I'm just kidding. So, uh, yeah, I think that's pretty much it. What, who's gone and stuff. And now, finally, Aaron and Gabriella have their own lovers. They're not really married yet, but they will be starting their lives with their partners now, which is good because now they're going to start the fourth generation. I think they're the first ones to start the fourth generation. And yeah, so. Wow, this guy has <laughs> this guy has a uh, the picture frame of Melissa and Scott on his head. I think I'm gonna just take that and put it upstairs where it actually belonged. I don't know how he got that on his head, but yeah, I'm gonna put that back in their room just because it's a lot of memories and stuff. By the way, Scott has his own little picture frame, but Melissa does not. I believe I don't know. Does she? Does she have her own? Am I just not seeing it? I don't know. But so far we only see Scott's. And now we need Melissa's in order to complete the uh, Elder paintings. So, unfortunately he probably doesn't have enough painting skill to paint her. But we will try and see. Uh, yeah. Where's the, the easel? Okay, the easel's over here. So, oh yeah, we can do that. Paint portrait of Melissa. Or actually, paint a custom painting. I have to do that real quick. By the way, also forgot to tell you guys this. Uh, as you can see, he's had a little bubble, little dream bubble over his head. He, Melissa and Scott are have now reached the top of their show business careers, and they also get paid five thousand twenty-two simoleons. Uh, and yeah, they both pretty much the same thing. Five thousand twenty-two simoleons. I don't know what else I was gonna say, but yeah, they reached the top of their career, so they pretty much just completed their whole life now. So they're all set till the end. Um, so they both are 64 days old, and I'm pretty sure both of them are going to last until about 70 to 8 day 80 days, and we might go through more than one day in this family because there's no one else to have age up besides Coco. So Coco is the only pet that's here, and that's fine. That's fine. Alright, so maybe it's not a custom painting. I think we're just going to paint something else. He's like screaming. Paint still life? Alright. Let's do that real quick. Let's paint. Let's do Melissa. Alright, so Melissa. Yeah, this is a good one. This is a good one. Let me get that in the center. Hopefully, you can do that. There we go. C to choose a subject. So he's going to paint her now. And he will take his time by doing that. Melissa, stop playing video games and answer the phone because it could be like Samantha or somebody important. But it's probably not, most likely. Ah, oh, maybe it is. It's Lori. Lori. Aunt. I mean, what would you call her? Would you call her an aunt? Because Josh and. Yeah, that's her aunt. Lori. Lori's aunt is Melissa and that's her niece. I think. Am I, this is right. Yeah, she's her niece. So yeah, I guess it's really good to get to know your nieces and nephews and stuff. And soon she'll be having grandchildren, so she's going to be a grandma. Right now she's not really a grandma yet, but she will be soon. My chair likes to make noises. It's like boom, boom, boom. Alright, so that's enough to talking to Lori. Getting a little bit to know her a little bit better since we don't really hang out with family members that much. So I think I'm gonna still have them go to work. I'm not sure. I think I should have them just retire, but I'm gonna wait until a little bit like about 68, 70, 67 to 68 days in their lifespan until they can retire. Just, I don't know why, but just, you know, we're rich already. Just keep it up, I guess. That guy is still here. I'm gonna ask him to leave because it's getting pretty late and you should be like going home. 
your wife or whatever is whoever is waiting for you at home even if you have someone to live with they probably might be worried I don't know goodbye goodbye stranger Ian Miguel I don't know I think he I think that's what Melissa brought from work actually Scott yeah Scott brought him from work or was it Melissa I don't know I don't think so so in this part I have no idea I keep saying this I have no idea what we're going to do since there's like not anyone else here anymore and it's just one of the sons Scott this pretty much this family is just a relaxing family I don't know why but I think I should stop recording this family and just let them live their lives and just you know have them da die off I know that, that sounds really bad but should I s should I keep recording this family or not because I mean there's nothing much productive we have to do we're pretty much fa finished with this family here and of course I can't turn them into plant sims or any other like supernatural I can't do that and they pretty much finished their jobs their careers and I think they're pretty much set on their lifetime once and all that because they're both in platinum they'll be like that for the rest of their elder lives so leave a comment uh, and whether or not I should keep recording this family because I think most of you still want me to record this because some of you like Melissa most of you like Melissa and she was a second generation baby second generation child old lady whatever you want to call her now it's pretty much a lot of memories you know she's been through her life you know we grew up with Melissa I guess a little bit with Scott I guess I guess I guess and they have pretty much a good life together they're destined to be with each other no problems whatsoever I don't think I mean some they might have died a couple of times but no, no they're pretty good and we have uh, I thought that was a genie that was all yellow and stuff I think that's just like a little statue I think when I keep this room like this because it looks pretty nice I guess pretty fancy and I did a little bit changes with the house if you haven't noticed um, Aaron's room is no longer a bedroom it's just some random computer room computer's still on but it doesn't matter and I also deleted the guitar here because it's not really used much it's not really used I think I should maximize max them out completely with their skills and all. Should I do that? I think I should do that. I'm not sure. Oh yeah, we also should work on the car. We should work on that. So I think Scott's progress with painting Melissa is going to be, you know, paced, and he's going to have to work on it like periodically. So I think we'll have him do that. For right now, let's just have him get ready for bed, as well as Melissa, because she's like staying up right now. Matter of fact, I'm actually gonna have them. Should I have them sleep in this bed? This one, for some reason, I don't like the style of this bed. I like this one better. I'm gonna have them sleep in that one. Melissa can be the first because I don't know. Ladies first. So I'll just wait for Melissa to get into bed for Scott first. Is she? Is she still climbing up the stairs? Okay, there she is. And they're still thinking about their recent uh, top job reaching thing. Wow, I can't talk. I don't know what to say. Alright, and I believe... Uh, I don't think there's a need to cut out. Let's just speed through this. Hopefully all of you have are having hopefully all of you are having a terrific Thursday. And tomorrow is that special day, Friday. Coco is still awake how is he he is fine he's just lacking a little bit of social and he needs to pee or take a dump pretty soon here in the litter box also yeah I deleted most I deleted Sam's old stuff since he's recently passed away that's all that's all scratch survey scratch sleep oh yeah our pet um hamster a pet hamster what's his name I read his name Tommy all right Tommy we've had this pet for a pretty long time now and uh, that pet has been with us for like many many parts hopefully it doesn't die right here 
if it dies, it'll let us. It'll give us like a notification of like if it dies or something. They have work today, right? Yep, 4 p.m. And oh, isn't that precious? Isn't that precious, guys? It's so precious. Let's have them both wake up now. Scott is a little social deprived. He's lacking on low on social. But I'm gonna have go ahead and feed Tommy real quick. I'm gonna clean this cage as well. Play with feed, feed him with food and then yeah. So Melissa, hurry up, hurry up. Hurry up and fill his dish. Alright. He is now eating. So, uh, let's go and have Scott actually not talk to Melissa, but talk to his uh, other family members and catch up with some people. So, hmm, we have the voodoo doll, don't we? We don't have the voodoo doll with us no longer anymore. So I think Aaron or Gabrielle looked at that with them. I think they, they both have it. I don't know. But yeah, I'm just going to have Scott go talk to Melissa now. He doesn't need to talk to anybody else. Oh, he gets social. He's low, doesn't he? Maybe not. Maybe because they cuddled in bed or something. Sucker face. Old people kissing. It's true love, though. It's true love. Gotta admit that. Oh, poor Sam. Poor Sam. I don't want to mourn for him, but if I mourn for him, I mean, he's not going to be coming out that much. Whatever. I miss you, Sam. So Coco says. Uh, let's go and have uh, Scott work on the machine, the car here. We're gonna work on the engine. Actually, work on the body. Actually, engine body. Work on the the freaking engine. Work no, 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 no. Work on the body. Okay. Someone's trying to call me. I don't know who that is. I have a feeling I know what the numbers. This is. Should I should I answer this? Zero zero. Says I'm scared. Ignore. Okay, well, I'm just not gonna answer that phone call. I just ignored it. Alright, so. Uh. Hopefully, nobody got a new phone in my family. If it's a really important, they're probably gonna call again, so. Yeah. Let's see. I'm gonna have, uh, Melissa make some omelets. Pretty much the same breakfast deal over and over again nothing too special he's just working on the body of the car I don't know how long it'll take but he has a pretty good mechanical skill pretty high mechanical skill so it shouldn't really take the longest like versus if you don't have a whole lot of mechanical skill where it will take like forever but let's just hope it doesn't take a long time and I find these cars pretty cooler looking some of these I mean Cooler looking than some of the other cars that Nightlife came with. So yeah, here's our maid. I don't think there's pretty much nothing much to clean up. Besides, I think that little newspaper right there. We have bills to pay off. Great. So she's got another cooking skill. Two more until she maximizes that. Max that out. What does her lifetime want? Become a game designer. The Sim has a lifelong change. She's the best in the game or career when this sucks. um I don't think that was her uh lifetime went before but it like changed now but her aspiration level is long lived levity liker levity liker and his is town father and he wants to graduate three children from college he only has two children <laughs> too bad too bad see how this car is going on. It's not really that much of a change, but speed this up. Oh, is he done with the bot? No, he's he's getting pretty close to being done with the body. As you can see, there's a major, there's like a major, but it's a minor difference there. 
and like I said if you were going to uh, work on a car in free time just let you guys know that it takes up most of your hygiene bladder and energy I think those three mood lit those moods and grab a plate of that and put actually no not grab a plate just one on the table for you Ooh. put away those leftovers and I'm gonna have Melissa work on the car as well so let's have her work on the engine they're gonna take turns doing their own little parts I think like smoke comes out of it if it like it's just a silly mistake After he's done eating that, I'm going to have him work on the body once again. Carful for Scott will arrive about an hour. What about Melissa? Don't they go at the same time? It should be the same thing. Make pottery and resurrect Mark. I don't know. I don't know if we're ever going to resurrect Mark or any of the other first generation members. I don't know. As you can see, it's not as like psh, screechy as before and it's just like smoother, relaxing, I guess. Did she finish it? I don't know. The inside looks better. Inside looks better. Ooh, we get a helicopter? <gasps> Ooh. I don't know if something this like this job could be so serious, but whatever. Go to go to work. Go to work, man. Go to work. In your fancy 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 schmancy helicopter. And this family also has the car. It's the Asper family. Ooh, Asper family. I wish we could actually like visit them since they're like really close right here. But we can't visit family mer family lots in Sims 2. Only Sims 3. What a shame. Que lastima. Que lastima. That's cool. Look at him. <laughs> Alright, and there goes the airplane. And that shall conclude today's episode of Let's Play The Sims 2 The Anderson Season 3 Part 52. If you liked the video, go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up. If you want to continue watching the series or any other series that you're interested in, why not click the subscribe button if you haven't already and you will be notified of when I upload. Also, follow me on my social networks such as Facebook or Twitter to get exclusive updates of when I'm going to upload or what I'm going to upload. And you'll be also notified on there of my uploading schedule that I update every Sunday. Um, of course, that schedule will tell you when and what I'm going to upload, and that's pretty much it. Hopefully, all of you have a wonderful day, and I will talk to you guys in another episode of The Anderson Season 3, Part 53, Part 53, tomorrow in Samantha's family. Dang, we're at 53 parts already. So until then, say awesome, and I love you all.